Hey, it's Pike. Welcome back to Abiotic Factor. I just went down to use the restroom down there, like by the locker rooms, and in the middle of doing it, a robot walked right past the door. <laughs> Pretty scary right there. need let's get some plastic and repair the shield and I gonna oh there's a guy that died in here yeah, let's package this attention this sector is under precautionary security measures. Please remain in place and wait for security assistance. So I probably need a third barricade then. Let's just put the water back here, I guess, just along these. Almost up to here. Let's craft another. It's gonna take paper. Let's put the sodas away. I guess because there's two in a stack, we'll use that. And it's gonna take some wood. Slightly, like, I had to twist it a little bit to get it to fit, but it's not too crazy out of the line. Hopefully they still just spawn over there and not just be like, oh, I can't get here, let me spawn over here. I guess I understand what, how it happened that I lost my flashlight that one time. I was just had in my inventory and... Like, it seems like it will stay if it's in your hot bar, but not if it's in your inventory. So we can hack through some doors. And it seems like it's reusable, which is nice. I am recording this. Clearance insufficient. Uh, class two.
Nah, I guess that doesn't. I need a different type of soda to wake me up. Guess that I'll fi try and find a couch to crash on. Sufficient. So it doesn't need to be here. I could probably get this to wake me up. Then it makes you need to go to the bathroom a bit, but it also wakes you up. Magazines, more magazines, make some armor with that. More bullets. Any idea what's going on? Oh, have you only got blue clearance too? I've been hiding here since those goons attacked that poor technician down there. Is he even still breathing? I can't bear to look. Something has happened to the perforation system. The portals have gone haywire. But that shouldn't be able to happen. If only we knew what was happening in labs right now. I'd assume that's maybe up where we were seeing all that up there, maybe. It was a zip line. <laughs> Into the trash. Oh, uh, that's what it's for. Clearance insufficient.
And a gun. Let's swap that in then. Biometric lock. This weapon seems to have some kind of security lock. Security system installed requires biometric arm wraps, so we can't use it. Biometric arm wraps. Yep, down here. That's the one I got, yeah. Biometric arm wraps. I see that's something that I'm gonna have to find that I can't craft. So we've done this. Let's go up to that where we found the lady that gave us the recipe for this hacker. Which is this broken staircase on the opposite side. Did you get those CPUs? I can't get my data until you make that hacker. Those bots are lethal, but taking one down and getting the CPU is the only way to rescue my data. That's something different. I perceive a distinct lack of snacks. Or gone equivalents. Oh, but they can teleport. He <laughs> fucked himself a little bit there.
Or heart. Let's drop. Yeah, we got those at home, so we can. We don't really need to build anything right now. I think that's also just auto places. I don't think we need the screwdriver to like build it up. Empty mug. More magazines. this let's check out this direction well I guess these other directions oh this will be a shortcut I wonder if I can just that tripped me out for a second I was like wait I'm going up <laughs> kind of like when you're in the bus and it feels like it's just slowly going backwards Let's just go down just to make sure I don't have to like go down to make sure it actually function down here. And with the loading we might have had to. Let's talk to her real quick. Did you get those CPUs? I can't get my data until you make that hacker. Painted water. Dr. Derek Mance, Cascade. The first instances of IS-064 appeared barely seconds after our first successful perforation event. It appears to exude a fog or mist that has overtaken Flathill entirely. The surviving residents have been evacuated and a cordon established around the town, citing a chemical spill. The residents, not to mention our counterparts at the EPA, are less than impressed. The knowledge we already gained, even in this short time, is beyond value. Ooh. Wired a screwdriver with two packets, so we do need it.
Is my shield broken? Like, why is it getting right past my shield? I believe I need to, uh, uh defecate. Yeah, I guess from it being broken, that seems like a glitch. So it broke while I was in my inventory, but even though I repaired it after, without like removing it from here, it still remembered it, its broken state somehow, even though it was fully repaired. You already have all of these. Let's just drop with that. I hate that you can't just drag and drop. That's something that they really need to add. Let's put this down over. Private note. It's undeniable that operations at Cascade are being monitored by external forces. This much, the Cascade Executive Committee have been permitted to know. Exactly who has been infiltrating our communications, and to what ends, remains unknown. Or rather, those who know, refuse to say. I've been directed to tell my team that we are conducting some security drills, but the threat seems quite real. And this is where that, I think over here is where that portal was. Yeah, you can see all that. I think, no, that's not the elevator. This is that room that I came in.
Ah. I noticed it earlier, but I forgot about it. So we're on level three. Let's grab the map. Good evening. It is 8 p.m. This sector will be powered down momentarily. If you have not already evacuated the facility, consider this your top priority. Have a wonderful and productive evening. Elevator level 2. This is where we came from. So this is Silo 3, where the lady's research is. That's where she was, I'm pretty sure. Executive's restroom. We went up here and through here. We're here. Level two maintenance lift. Yeah, I think that's where we came up probably. Level two lift. Dr. Derek Mance reporting, research director. As our understanding of perforation technology grows, we have discovered new facets of its physical laws. One of the most fascinating is temporal tethering. We seem to step back into each antiverse at the same moment. It is as though each entry to an antiverse sets a timer, which resets a Yeah, I guess we'll just have to go back the way we came. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.